Welcome, welcome to my new host. So in the previous in the previous episode guys, we were busy stocking up the foundation beams. Trying to figure out where we're gonna put this area. I uh, just wanna dispatch this wolf quickly. Yeah, yeah. Gotcha. But I love that bolt in aim assist stuff. Uh, yeah, so you can see we're busy trying to build the roof um, Because we we lack a lot of the resources that we need <laughs> Mostly constructed out of stone <laughs> We did have uh, we did have the ability to build the perimeter um, Frames or foundations out of concrete and that is gonna give out that give us that uh, structural stability that we're looking for um, as you can see we on the corners here we've got some uh, concrete uh, beams as well to give it that extra st stability um, and uh, yeah we basically we started off with you know the wood beams uh, to give us that framing of like where do we want to put this uh, etc we're gonna be putting a patio out in the front here so it's not just gonna be this dry and boring uh, but this is essentially what we have thus far. So essentially what we're going to have when we come into uh, the main area, we have our mission board right in front, uh, and then a little seating area, you know, if you want to sit down and just wait for, you know, someone coming in. Like kind of, you know, when you go to the doctor, you got a seating area, you can just sit down and wait, you know, just sit here and wait uh, if that waiting area is full. Uh, and then if, it would be nice to put a TV here, but obviously we don't have those types of things. Um, underneath the staircase, we, I decided to put some storage of, you know, pretty much anything that we can't kind of just like jam into any other typical uh, chest or storage component. So we have our uh, charcoal on this side and all of our worm stuff uh, on that side. And if we go to this room, we've moved the bungalow now to inside here. Um, nice high ceiling so we can jump around in here. Uh, and we just moved some armor um, stuff and yeah pretty much just put all the stuff that we had laying around uh, that was in the bungalow already actually and we just moved everything and then I made this my bed over here because it's the closest one to the door <laughs> um, and because it's closer to the the fire pit itself or the what is this this is a fireplace uh you can see inside here we are pretty much empty i pulled out everything um from the kitchen side i still need to empty out all of the stuff here and if we go upstairs i need to figure out the plan of action for how we're gonna do the um the building area because i want to keep things um sort of like things that relate to each other close by. So everything right now, as it is in this workshop, air quotes, uh, we have just kind of like dumped everything down. So I kind of want to have um, in the new section, I want it to be everything that I would be using in that space, easy to access and be like right there for me. So for example, um, like this wing will be just like, smelters so we put all the furnaces and stuff in one corner and then we put like two or three or four or five or two thousand if i <laughs> if i want to we can put some anvils along the side um you know so you make it a proper workshop You've got all the space available i'm gonna use it also um all these walls they're just placeholders for the time being i'm gonna be replacing a lot of them um once we start putting things in we're gonna start replacing them with glass and um, the whole idea with uh, this big new base is so that I could actually use the resources or the other types of uh, building material inside my base. So I'm not going to use thatch because I don't like the way the thatch looks. Um, but I can I can use some wood. I'll be able to use some of the interior wood, um, some of the stone. Just trying to scroll over there so you get like you see we've got the interior wood uh railing i would like to try some of that um the reinforced railing i would also like to do some of that we've got some stone and we've got the aluminium and concrete stuff as well i just want to get to that 
So yeah, I mean, there's, there's a bunch of things um, that I haven't used yet that I would like to incorporate that into the base build as well and see if we can get um, that goal achieved at least. So um, yeah, so what, we, what do we need to do today? We need to go back to the original base and we need to confirm if we have enough to continue. Otherwise, we are going to be grinding. Alrighty, so <clears throat> we just had to have a little bit of a nap, grab some food, and uh, let's get going to get those pieces of uh, the, the roof done. Okay, so we put the last one here, other one, no, <laughs> other one, there we go, that one. Okay, cool, and then... I need to do 12. 1, 2, 3. Did I miscalculate, dude? Because I have those ones there already. I think I miscalculated. Damn it. Uh, I did. I mean, I can go another one higher, but I don't know. Let's see how that's gonna go. Um. That one's gonna go up, so we'll do that, that, and that. Can we go another one higher? We can. Sheesh, that's gonna be high. Uh, yeah, let's go with it. Um, I don't think I'll be able to go higher than that, though. My goodness, I can. That's gonna be the top, right? That's gonna be very tall. Because we need to extend this to make this uh, the roof over here. And then we might, might need to put a beam over there. Maybe. <laughs> uh, okay. <clears throat> we need to grab that one. So this one's going one more up. One more like that. And then we do these two. Ooh, yeah, he's not happy with that one. That's gonna collapse. That's gonna collapse. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised that those ones are holding up. Shoot. Okay, let's go get the. I need to. I need to make. Um. One, two. I need two more. Laws, and then we need one, two more, two more walls because we just we just lost an extra one. So we need two more walls and two more floors. Ah, uh, okay. Let's go get that sorted out quick. Now, like a dummy, I made all of these, and I need more stone again. Alright, let's go get more stone. I'll see you guys in a bit. Alrighty. So, we are gonna correct that mistake we made. Uh, and then we... Yeah, those two. So, that one. We don't need this extra one now. Uh, let's just put these down. Alright, like that. And what I'm concerned about now is I'm probably going to have to be putting some supports for these as well. I have to put some beams down. But that's okay, because if we do that, then I want to do also a skylight at some point. So when you do a skylight, we're going to need to have some structural integrity as well. So let's see if I can win by getting this in there. If you guys hear a dog barking, it's my dog. I am so sorry. That guy looks okay there, right? Okay. Let's... <clears throat> Let's go see... 
we can make some beams because <laughs> we sort of can't continue right now until we get those beams supporting the rest of that weight. Like that. Like that. Alrighty. So that gives it that structural integrity it needs straight through the middle. I think that's good to go. And then now this is going to be the fun one to see how far we can go with these. So these perimeter ones should be okay. And I think the safety number is five. If I'm not mistaken, I can go five um, before it starts falling apart. So we're going to try that up now, if we have enough. Oh goodness. No! It's going to break. Dang it! Maybe I should have moved it. I think it's... I think it's structurally sound over here at number four, and it needs to be at number five. Uh, I don't know. Okay, so what if we do... Um, the problem with it being like this is now if we have heavy winds or something, it's going to bring this thing down. So that's not ideal. Hmm, what we can do... I think what we need to do is we need to reevaluate what we're going to do here. Okay, so where was I working? I was working here. So what we need is, it's one, two, is that, that looks like it's the middle, yeah, okay, I don't want to do it like that rather, so then it's got a nice space between them, so if I do, shoot dude, uh, it's not happy there. Ah, uh, dang it. I don't know what to do here, guys. Uh, that's a tricky one to try to fix because I really, really, really don't want to have to put us all around the, the building. Hmm. All right. I gotta, I gotta make another plan. I'll see you guys in a bit. Okay, guys. So I managed to figure it out. Uh, it's not the greatest, um, but it works. So yeah, I'm a little disappointed. Uh, gonna have to do it uh, flat roof, um, and then these walls between it uh, to keep the structural integrity without things breaking. Uh, I couldn't get around any other way. So. I think with uh, building this size, uh, you're going to struggle with getting structural integrity uh, correct if you don't have pillars everywhere. I don't like the look of having pillars everywhere, so yeah, so this is the happy medium I could find, putting a wall between, it'll subdivide the weight. Um, and this is directly down the middle of it, you can see it's going both sides. Um, <clears throat> Unfortunately, you can't avoid it, uh, at least from this design and what I could find. Um, I would love to know from your if you guys have encountered something like this, uh, and uh, if you've managed to find a solution, because this is sadly disturbing that I can't get it to look the way I wanted it to. So, we need to get some food in my system. Uh, we'll grab this one, and we'll grab, do we have, oh, we have that ready, so we'll do this, 
Alright. Getting green from one of these, so that's good. Alright. So, it's just these two that I can leave. I can remove that. So, green still. Good. Uh. Wait, that one's yellow. Why is that one yellow? It's green. That one's green. Take that one out. Deploy it against that one. Still yellow. That's strange. Hmm. If I remove this one, it's gonna have issues as well. Let's try. Yeah, that one's yellow for some weird reason. The rest are green. Green? Green, 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 green. So strange. I don't know. I um, can't figure out why it would do that. Hey guys, uh, so <laughs> after that storm passed, we saw that uh, our base was taking some damage, as you can see here. So what I did was I decided to rather go ahead and make some stone uh, floors so that we can upgrade. Oh lord, why is this breaking? Seems like the weight distribution is not okay. So these things will have to... Oh, that's a bit unfortunate. I think it's fine when you have the wood, but uh, with the stone, obviously it's heavier, so... That's super awkward. Um... Yeah, he doesn't like that. Okay, let's go get the wood uh, beams. Is it pillars? They are technically pillars, but I got rid of them all. No, <laughs> dang it! Alrighty, let's go get the resources. And if I go ahead and do this now. Why? I think it's because it doesn't have any support underneath it. Yeah, shoot. Let's try this. Yeah. Dang. Okay. That's annoying, um, but we're actually not using this one over here now. So let's take this one out. We're not even using that other one, so... That one back. And we go. Oh, why is <laughs> on the wrong way around? No, dude, come on. Don't do that. Okay, he's got a yellow, but it's not falling apart, which is better. You know what I'm thinking? What if I take... Yeah, it doesn't need that. Take that one out there, and that one out there. And do the load balancing over here, rather. Hmm... That seems to work a little better. Do we have something over here for this one? We don't. So we should probably put one here. To give it that load be bearing. Okay. Uh, and when I start replacing these now, it's going to start giving me the same drama.
and we are the stone. Then we need more stone to replace this. So essentially, what needs to be done now is we need to replace all this all this wood here. One, two, three, four, seven, ten, thirteen, sixteen, nineteen. We need nineteen more um, stone floors, and we're gonna have to just figure out where the stability is. Um, the structural integrity of it is and then uh, make our way around that oh okay so guys I think I'm gonna call it here then what we'll do in the next round or the next episode is we'll more than likely have this uh, upgraded um, we'll do some off-camera work and hopefully we'll have this sorted out uh, because it's quite tedious going to get all those resources, making the uh, structural bits, and then putting it all together. Oh, hello. Bacon. I'll have me some bacon, thank you, sir. Going into here quickly. Good to have myself some bacon. Actually, I'm taking them. It's just gonna be easier. Okay. Yeah, because as you can see, guys, this does not look very great. Not what I had planned it to look like. It was it was meant to be nice and tall and have some shape to it, and it's just not getting that shape through. So yeah, we're gonna we're gonna make some progress off camera. So you guys have to <laughs> sit with me and watch me mine all these things out and all the rest of that boring stuff. Um, if you guys have enjoyed this video, please make sure you smash that, that like button and subscribe if you're new and you haven't already. I really, really appreciate that. Um, and yeah, well guys, we'll see you in the next one. Uh, have a good one. Peace.